Alright guys, we got a bite me box tip up up here. Good note to it. Got the heat on today. Charcoal in the box, keeping the hole nice and toasty. The lake of the woods where you definitely need the heat. Oh, look at the smoke coming out of there. Oh yeah. Straight down though, I think. Nice and toasty warm, those coals cooking in the can. Yeah, straight down. Again. There he goes. That might be the minnow. Yeah, the sweat on the box. Nice and warm. There we go. Look at that reel turning. It's nice and free with it. Oh, let me focus here. Nice and free with that heat in there. That makes a big difference. Down there trying to swallow that sucker. <laughs> yeah. There he goes. There he goes again. Yeah, oh, taking yeah. him. Oh, yeah. Swivel that reel right back out of the way. A lot of room, ten inch hole. Get that fish out of there. See what we got. There's some way right there. Oh, did he just drop it? I think so. <laughs> oh, I don't know, maybe not. Yeah, he's there. He's there. Fish on. A little bit of weight. Bit. Yeah. Feeling wingy. <laughs> My head bumps him. And walleyes to do that too. Yeah. We got a golden eye. Oh, yeah. Easy buddy, easy. Easy, look. Easy. Easily can get it. Right. Nice. That's a good eye. That's a nice one. You can see he's got all that line laying out on the ice here. Don't forget, you fish Minnesota. Gotta have that little blade on that treble hook. Little blade, yep. Yeah, you can't just use a straight treble hook in Minnesota. With all that line on there, cold day like that, that would all freeze right back on the reel. But with them hot coals in there, you'll wind that back on there real quick. Reel pulls forward, you can wind all the line on easy. And them coals will thaw everything right back out and it's free wheeling again. Put that on an underwater tip up like that, all that will freeze into a ball. And There's a nice sucker. Nice oh, little size bait we're using. The way to do it with these tip ups. We're running them three, four feet off the bottom, picking up them bigger fish. Look at him down in there. Oh, yeah, that's a nice, lively. That's what we're looking for. If they're not hungry, they'll hit her out of aggression. And you'll watch, you can pull that reel forward and wind that line right back on there after he gets it all down. Box, oh, huh? You can feel that heat coming off oh, of there. Yeah, she <laughs> yeah, doubles the hands get cold. When you run charcoal in, you can run a candle in them, but you can't beat charcoal. Doesn't blow out, throws off so much more heat. Pulls that reel right forward. You can wind that around there real quick. That's what's nice about picking them up. And at the end of the day, too, they wind up so quick. You got that cork in there, you put the clicker on, nothing gets tangled. Show the setup of this here too when he pulls the pull that flag right up. Turn that peg down and you That's swivel the reel right up to it. You just 
set the arm right on the peg. And that's, there's a slide weight there too, but you can run that forward or back if you're fishing perch to make it more sensitive. Everything set. Good to go. All right, close her up. Wait for the next one. All right, nice catch. The flag on the bite me. See my split shot. It's warm in there, eh? Yeah, it's nice in here. Yeah, he's got line tight out this way. Okay. I'm gonna look outside. Get real back out of the way. Any big. Oh, there he is. There he is. Dude, he was up off the bottom. Fish on. What the All heck? Right. We got him. He's right here. Dude. What the hell is this? Oh the my play. god. Boy. All Probably right. the same one I just caught. <laughs> oh, what's Settle that all about? <laughs> Settle down. Settle down, buddy. Settle down. We're gonna end up. We're gonna end up releasing this fish because we got Seriously. our limit of eaters already today. So we're out here looking for something, something for the wall. But that's still a darn nice fish. Yeah, there ain't nothing wrong with that. All these throwbacks. Oh, it's got to be. That's a good 18-inch walleye. Get out of there, yeah, nice. can you hold it like this? Yep, get a hold of it so we can release this baby back. Somebody else to catch. It's getting hard to see in there now. Oh, he's got it down in there too. Come on, give me that sucker back. There, now I can see. Pull it up, Terry. Okay. All right. I'm just fine. I'll put her back. Oh, there geez. she goes. <laughs> All right. Nice and get, this, sweet. get this rig back up and get another one. We're looking for that big 30 incher. This is what... <laughs> Add another one to the pile. <laughs> like I said, we've already got our limit today and we're just running two tip ups. We're doing some jigging, picking some up jigging, but these bigger fish are definitely coming on these tip ups. For the most part, anyway, with the bigger sucker minnows. Something nice to uh, add to your arsenal of fishing here when you're out on Lake of the Woods. Or any other lake, for that matter. Alright, we'll check in with you when we get the next one. Hopefully we get something we can put on the wall.